Hey everyone, I'm Chef Curtis, and we're talking about food, food as medicine. I chose red peppers to use today, and there's a reason that I chose red. There's actually about three times the amount of vitamin C in a pepper than in an orange. Whoa! Yes, and specifically red peppers. So that's mind why blowing. I like to choose yeah, these. Yes. Yeah. All right, well, there's yeah. the emoji with the mind blowing that I'm gonna send it out so you guys can see. <laughs> now, here we go. We're using brown rice because it is a whole grain, so it's higher in fiber, higher in protein, keeps you full longer, and it controls your blood sugar. Fresh tomatoes aren't available. Mm -hmm. And I find canned tomatoes on sale at the market. Uh -huh. Is oh, it okay absolutely. to use those? I love canned tomatoes myself. Easy and quick prep. Mm -hmm. What you want to look for is low sodium or no salt added. Then we've got the beautiful diced onions. Beautiful right? diced onions. Mm -hmm. Those are fresh, but they could be frozen as well. What I love is that we're using herbs to give this dish flavor, as well as the, the garlic. So mm -hmm. we're not adding a lot of salt, a lot of seasonings. We just have that really nice, fresh flavor. I love it. I love yeah. it. Now, everything is prepped except yeah. one item. We're going to slice right through the pepper sideways like that, OK? Now, you see how that is? We're going to remove the seed pocket. Careful, don't rip up your pepper. We're gonna heat that oven to 350, and we're gonna bake them for about 20 to 30 minutes. I want you to check them after about 15 minutes. If they're nice and tender, bring them out. Oh, what do you think, Emily? Those look good, they huh? Smell delicious, mm. yes. I'm ready to eat now. <laughs> Me too. So, um, shall we plate them up? Yes. All righty. Do a little sprinkle of parsley. All right. What do you think, Curtis? I love it, I love it. Well, I hope you enjoy this recipe. I'm Chef Curtis with my friend. Emily. Bon appetit.